Hi, it's me again with Corona Tips and Tricks. I just did a video on this. I thought I'd go ahead and show this. I don't think it's as cool, but I thought I'd show you a couple of steps. I've already made uh, this item from the previous video, part one. I'm going to make a box. So this time I'm going to use a six-sided polygon. And then I need to make a box. So I'm going to take a two-point line and go from that node to this, well, to the center and then go from there to that node and then go up and now I have the four shapes of a box. Now, there's a lot you could do with it, but what we're gonna do is just turn it blue so we can see it and we're gonna go to object order. Well, it's already in the front of page. Yep, so we can see it. Now, I'm gonna make four, uh, three duplicates of this. I really only need two, but I thought Somebody just beginning off might want to. So we've already taken it and removed all the nodes. So I'm going to just kind of set that one in that corner. I'm going to grab the envelope tool and I'm going to bring that one up to there. That one over there. And that one over there. Now earlier I said I only need two of them. Because I could take this and hit the plus key. And just mirror it over. So I've got that. Now I need this shape. And this is what I really wasn't happy about. Somehow I need to uh, change this shape a little bit. I'm going to try it. Uh, take the shape tool and grab that. Well, let me del let me delete these two nodes. And I'm going to bring this shape. Whoop, can't do it. Because it's a polygon, so I'm going to go to object and convert it to a curve. And then I can bring in that shape and it's going to make it maybe look more like a cube. You know, who knows? It, I think it does a little bit. Now all we have to do is, because this one's already, uh, that looks a little funky, but you could play around. Just go ahead and set that thing right to that node. We've already, you know, done the envelope part, you know, by getting rid of the nodes. Let's zoom in here and get that right on that corner. A little bit harder said than done. And then let's get the envelope tool. We've already reduced them to uh, lines. So we can just play with this. And this way I can see my box in the background. Of course, I'm going to have to zoom in. Eh, kind of looks catawampus. But it's a neat effect. And let's just change it back to where I uh, had it earlier. Would make it a square. There we go. And to me, that just looks kind of funny. But we can do some other things, maybe. Let's take this and put it right there on that node. Grab our envelope tool. There. There. And there. Pretty cool effect. And then I would get rid of the blue line. And then you could take away the lines on this. And just have that effect. I like the lines on this particular one. You could make the little line a little thicker to give it a cube effect. There might be some other ways we could do something. Let's, uh, well, I'll say that for another video someday. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.